YouTube guys and girls, what is up? I have missed you guys. Like, what the heck? We're back with GTA 5 Online. And I got some requests for tips and tricks for the marksman. So with that being said. So if you're among those handful of people who like using like between the heavy sniper and the marksman and you like sniping in GTA, you've probably, maybe, possibly gotten the text in GTA or like a voice message or something for using a marksman and actually killing the other tryhard player and they're like, you're using a marksman, like you're trash for using marksman. It's like I respect players for using heavy sniper, like it's badass, but at the same time, Marksman isn't really like a weak weapon. It's like you don't just run like I mean running to your like your jet or something Okay, that's a little bit much. So with that being said guys like the marksman also takes a bunch of like timing precision control and stuff like that um, Like when you're sniping somebody with the marksman you might notice because of its recoil like how it bounces back because it's popping so quick you might notice like your bead of the gun like isn't it keeps jumping over your opponent you're gonna want to like strafe your character to like get back into that timing it's kind of like having like an off rhythm in a song you want to like pace yourself back so you can like actually hit them and not just keep bouncing you know over them and stuff those of you who are like lower ranks or you're new at gta you're like starting out beginning on sniping even the worst thing you could probably do is keep rolling because I know it seems like rolling is like the magical way to avoid somebody shooting you but that's because you're using lock aim like GTA is like a lock aim game so obviously you want to break like the lock and the marksman and heavy sniping they're both free aim no matter what you do and I mean if you're against like a more skilled person or like just like an average player even, they have a good chance of seeing you go down rolling and if they keep shooting with the marksman especially, they have a bigger chance of hitting your head or something. And if it's heavy sniper, they can just wait for you to pop back up and then boom and then you're wasted. So I mean, you really want to avoid rolling because that for sniping is just not the better way out. Hey, um, I need water. Also, like. First person is hands down the best way to snipe in this game. Um, there are a lot of people actually who are great at third person and I'm like, you know, third person sniping, that's a definite skill. And I mean, we all had to back on last gen. So I mean, first person just made it so much easier. But um, also with the marksman, it's just, it's really good to know your control because it does, it does have that pop anyway. Like no matter how maxed out your shooting skill is, you're gonna really want to like know how to strafe. All together, it's just a matter of just really messing with it and seeing what makes it more comfortable for you. So all this being said guys, thank you so much for your support. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for just dropping by, you know, watching a video or whatever. Like you guys are all awesome. Um, I'm hoping to have like a collage of some of you have sent like my clips or my clips who have sent me your clips and um like your youtube channels or like your gaming if you want to do that just message me on xbox gamertag is my user or my my name on youtube so i can't talk today and other than that i will see you on the flip side and i am shay <laughs> you guys have